Your WXII 12 forecast is always available on the free WXII 12 app. Stay connected with meteorologist Brian Slocum on his Facebook page. All right, let's talk travel. Uh, the next couple of days are going to be a little dicey for the Midwest. And of course, with all the planes flying around that could back up the whole system. We have a couple of systems are watching strong winds from New Mexico uh, through the southern plains and into the Midwest are a good possibility for the next 24 hours. This storm uh, out over Denver now is now lifting through Nebraska. Hundreds of flights have been canceled in and out of Denver already from that storm system. So good luck if you're traveling over the next couple of days. We have clear skies here locally. Temperatures this morning are chilly. We're starting out in the low to mid 30s this morning with a chilly corner from Martinsville to Danville to Rockingham and Caswell County that is just below 30 degrees this morning. We'll start to bring in clouds gradually today, still predominantly sunny and even a little milder than yesterday with a high of 63. Southwest winds at 5 to 10. In the foothills, a high of 61 with a light breeze out of the south. Mountain temperatures starting out in the 30s and 40s, warming up to near 60 degrees a bit later in the day today. So let's get through the next uh, little while anyway. Clouds start to gather. High clouds come in first, and that canopy could look a little overcast from time to time, but more than likely that won't happen until this evening. It's dry overnight. That's when the heavy clouds move in, and we'll start to see some rain moving into our western areas and then tracking through the triad tomorrow morning should exit midday, and we start to clear from there. So by Wednesday evening, if you're traveling after work, you're in good shape here, and especially in the Carolinas to Virginia. A second storm coming off the Pacific will begin to move into the Pacific Northwest uh, by midweek and then start to overspread the area. If you're those who are flying out west, this could certainly become problematic. It will continue to gain strength as it crosses the nation. Here we are Saturday into Sunday. And we've got rain moving in locally. And the secondary storm could make it difficult for you to get back. So that's something you need to check and maybe kind of weigh these options going forward. But yeah, we've got a storm system that could affect you getting out of town and then getting back in the town over the next couple of days. Locally, our weather looks fine. We will have some rainy weather on Sunday and it will cool down by Monday again.